also domestic supply is very, very important yep. here. And we're going to be hearing some more about this this week, particularly the controversial move that Liz Truss campaigned on to lift this ban on extracting British natural shale gas, on fracking. Now, I've been following the fracking debate in this country very, very closely, as I know you, you have too. And during that announcement that Liz Truss made just before uh, Her Majesty's unfortunate um, funeral and, and so on, she mentioned she was going to lift the moratorium on fracking that came in. It was imposed by Boris Johnson just before he went for uh, an election, just before he went to increase his majority. He thought it would appeal to younger people and environmentalists to ban fracking. That ban is now being lifted. Liz Truss said in the Commons a couple of weeks ago she thinks by lifting the ban on fracking within six months that means wells that have already been drilled, they're ready to go mostly, particularly in the northwest uh, near Blackpool, uh, drilled by a firm called Quadrilla, mm. uh, would be bringing gas, domestic shale gas, on stream within six months. A lot of people poo-pooed that idea. They said that's completely ridiculous. So I asked Francis Egan, who happens to be the CEO of Quadrilla, mm. whether or not this six-month uh, time frame was reasonable, doable, and this is what he said. Quadrilla has two existing wells that we've already drilled into the uh, shale rock uh, in Lancashire, just outside of uh, Blackpool. And in fact, we had uh, partially uh, fracked and, and tested uh, gas back to the surface from those, those wells. So we know the gas is already there. So we would have to mobilise equipment back. So that's Francis Egan. He's confirming that six months is doable. He also says, in his view, environmentalists disagree. There's a bright future for the UK if we fully embrace fracking. It's just a start, of course. This this is not, uh, you know, intended to be a, a sticking plaster solution for the for the immediate energy price rises. Shale gas, as we all know, has the potential to supply gas for for decades. So I think this is a very important part of a of an ongoing supply strategy. And and I think the government is finally realizing that domestic uh, gas supply is a very important uh, thing to have, and we can't be wholly or even primarily reliant on on imported gas.